Walking that bitch on my toilet. Walking that bitch with the O's. They bit it, they bite it, they look. Hello everybody and welcome to another MX Bikes video and today guys we're at a brand new free motocross track here made by Nugget Boy, a German track creator. That right there is the name of the track. I'm not going to try to say it because I don't speak German, but uh, this track's amazing. Got a lot of steep uphills, downhills, lots of roughness, huge tabletops, and overall just a really, really fun track to ride. I think this track will be very popular in public lobbies and very, very fun to race as well with a bunch of different line choice. But it provides this challenge, a challenge that I actually end up seeing throughout this video that I didn't know was actually there. When I first got on the track, I'm like, oh, this track's gonna be kind of easy, it's a free track. Like, I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking, but I wasn't thinking it was gonna be as hard as it was. But it ended up being super, super fun, and I had a ton of fun and challenged myself on this track trying to run some heaters. So hit that someone at that like button. There's also a few funny moments in this video uh, towards the end where I sort of wadded myself. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. But yeah, we hit 70,000 subs as well, so thank you guys. Enjoy the video. Let's get right into it, boo. All right, boys, we are in here at... I'm going to try to say the name of the track here. Bielsteiner Waldkurs. Uh, that's the American way of saying it. I'm not going to try to speak German. I don't know anything about German. I actually took four years of Spanish, though, uh, when I was in school. I don't actually remember anything from that. I just I suck at learning languages, I think. I don't know. Anyways, boys, second track from the boy here. Um, very, very good. And it, it feels a lot like a Kells track. It's, it's wide, it's upscaled, but he still has these technical lines and sections with, you know, roughness and ruts. And it, it, it just, it's not a track where you can just go wide open. And a lot of these tracks in Europe are very, as you can see here, they have very steep downhills and uphills. They have like steep off camber turns. I love those type of sections in this game. Um, cause you to slow down. And, you know, this game recently has gotten pretty fast pace you know with these bikes these new oems that we got in december they're just very good bikes they're almost you know too good in a sense or you can just send it as hard as you want and so it's cool to get tracks that you know they are upscale they are wider you know there is obviously sections where you can pin it but you can also you know be forced to slow down a little bit be forced to put a setup on your bike because there's a lot of roughness and uh, i don't know i just find that stuff really really cool and Nugget Boy, dude, I'm going to tell you something right now. I did not play his first track. Um, but I looked at it on the mods page just to check. Because I was like, is this, is this his first track? Well, it is his second. His first track actually looks really good. And I completely, I don't even know what happened. I don't know if I even ever saw it on the mods page. But I think it was around a month ago that he released that. So kind of disappointed in myself for missing that. Um, but yeah, we're here with the second track. And he's absolutely killing it. I love the way he's building his tracks. They are both free. And they're just, they look like they're just going to be super fun for pub lobbies, you know, not super hard. Um, nothing that's going to, you know, catch you too off guard, even if you're a newer player. You just kind of have to learn the layout, learn the lines. And they can have a lot of fun on tracks like this. I think it's something like this, if you're a newer player, could seriously get you prepared for trying to do AMs for the outdoor series or trying to qual for, for pro even. Um, there's a lot of technical sections on here. And if you try to go fast around here, you're going to, you're probably going to bite it. So we are going to have some fun. Again, we're on the Yamaha 450. I probably will stick with this bike, honestly, for the rest of Supercross and then going into outdoors. I'm probably going to do some testing, though, going outdoors. Try to find a good setup and really try to prepare myself here. But, oh my goodness, did not get that double. I'm not sure where the finish line is because I want to try to run some good laps. Looks like a 208 is my fastest time. So we are going to start to look at some lines around here, see if we can find some secret stuff. Can I launch this somewhere? Ooh, nah, I definitely can't launch that to the downhill. Oh my god. A tough block had collisions, so I had absolutely no idea. But you go down this straightaway, I'd say probably going right. It's probably quicker here, and then fading to the outside. Can you rail this? Oh, he did not build up a very big berm, which is pretty smart, because that outside would be kind of OP, to be honest. So looks like middle rut's probably the best there. Go inside. Go over the street. I'm not sure if that's there in real life. I'm guessing it is. That's pretty cool. Just grab this uphill double. This double's massive. Turn here. Oh my goodness. Go around this corner. Into that rut. Fly up this. I'm pretty sure down here is the off-camber turn. Wherever if you hug the outside, you can avoid the roughness a little bit. Nope, dude. This track is like... This track is deceivingly hard, bro. My bike is not going to stop here. <sighs> I 
This guy got me folding, bro. Alright, let me try outside here. Pretty flat, no real berm. Probably fly down to this. Dude, the freaking downhills are gnarly on this, bro. This is awesome. Scrub the table, sit down. I still don't know where the finish line is. Might be one of these tables. Let's see here. No, it's not this table. Alright, can we like do a Jet Lawrence line right here? Oh, kinda. Oh, there's like a little lip right there. I'm gonna try to hit that next lap. I think finish line's right here. Where is the finish line? Okay, it should be right after the start right here. I think. Yeah, it is. Alright, bet. Alright, we're gonna heater. I think I have my ghost turned off. That's why I can't see it. I was so confused. Alright. Oh, I see a marker flying in the sky right there. Let's go outside. Dude, this roughness is crazy. Stand up around that. Sit down. Slow down here. Oh, that was bad. Landed right on that. Bump. We're gonna go... I'm gonna go inside, actually, here. I'm gonna go middle right around to this. Jump. Oh, God. Go. Dude, it's kind of hard to get traction here, too. I'm not sure what soil he used. Oh, that was an OJ. Holy moly. Alright, it's still a pretty good lap, though, so far. Might be a little cut line there. He's got a marker, like, way onto the track. Fly around up here. Double. He's flying his inside. Sit down. Oh, turn, turn, turn. I'm not turning. It's not turning. Jump down here. I have to be cautious right here. Oh my goodness. These downhills are gnarly, bro. In pub lobbies, you'd get absolutely sent right there. Okay, you can actually triple over that. Double. Just normal table. Yeah, it's a normal table. You probably send that, though. Another table here. Okay, I'm gonna try this line. Oh, that's kind of OP. Into that rut. Let's try an outside line here. Yeah, his outside berms are pretty flat, so I think the insides are insides are probably the best lines. Let's see if this lap counts or not. Come on, baby. Nope, it didn't. All right, we go again. We go inside this time. That did not work. Holy. All right, boys, we go again. I think outside is definitely the move here. You just, it's hard to get into that rut without a lot of speed on the inside. Fly into this, scrub. Holy shiesty. Oh, I sat down. My ass is definitely bruised, dude. Oh my god. Oh. Don't want to go outside here, but it's okay. Dude, th bro. These bumps are crazy. I'm gonna go full send down this downhill. Better go outside. Oh my god. I can tell, like, he really paid attention to where these bumps are, because they are in spots where, like, you really can't send certain stuff. There's probably still one good line around every corner that's, like, super fast, but... I like this, dude. He actually made this really challenging. Super deceiving track, because when I looked at the pictures on MXB mods, I'm like, oh, just another free track, gonna be easy peasy. This track's kind of tough, bro, I'm gonna be honest. This is a track that you guys can use to learn on. If maybe you're not sure about buying the outdoors rounds or the MXGP rounds, these tracks, I think his first one too, really good for learning because they are not easy, dude. Let's see if I can triple in here. Oh, definitely not. I feel like inside's like way OP right there. I would say maybe you could add a few more lines in certain corners because it does feel like some lines are like a little bit more viable than others. 
But for the most part, I'm actually really surprised by this. I want to go check out his first track now. There's a marker. I think that's a marker in the air right there. That's the only air I've seen so far. Everything else is fine. The timing gates are good. You can stay in them. Oh my goodness. Soil is a bit slippery too, which I don't really know why. Could still be just normal soil. I'm just bad at the game. Alright, let's do a heater here. I guess I need to slow it down a little bit. W bruh. I could have swore there was a rut right there. I feel like my front end just got absolutely just completely yossed. It was just the ground texture, bro. I don't know what just happened. This track's low-key owning me, though. Alright, hold this inside. Scrub. Scrub. Alright. Scrub down this. Get on the old gas. Fly this. Go middle right here. I cannot turn. Gonna take this slow. Okay, we cannot OJ this. This is super easy to OJ. Okay, that was literally perfect. Go nice and slow around these flat corners. Trying to use this berm to apex to this corner. Double this. Alright, now this is where it gets real sketchy, dude. These downhills are crazy, bro. We come to this inside, sit down. Hit this inside. This downhill is okay. We're fine. Go across the street. We have to air this out. Oh, I, I'm gonna see Jesus here. Oh, never mind. We're fine. Uh, seems my prediction was correct. We indeed saw Jesus. Uh, <laughs> that was that was bad, bro. Uh, hopefully this lap still counts. I feel like I haven't ran a single lap that counts when I turn this camera on. It, I don't know what's going on. This track is so fun, though. It's, an e it's a track I could easily get addicted to. Rail this. I wish the outside was railable. You just hit the same line from the inside, too. I don't know, I would say literally my only, like, critique is just some of the corners I feel like are pretty one line, because I don't think people are going to take multiple. Alright, that lap counted, thank goodness. But other than that, amazing. Hard. A lot harder than I expected. Lots of, you know, elevation change, up and down. It is a replica. Um, so obviously it makes sense, but I don't know, I like European tracks a lot more than the American layouts, to be honest. Alright, a new American should come after me, alright? But these, like, Steep up and down hills, like I don't know, they're just so much fun to ride. Just a whole other like variation. And I know they don't work too well with this game, but as far as how he scaled, it actually works really good. All right, we're in an absolute heater here. Nice. All right, I'm gonna sit down. I'm gonna sit through this whole section here. Stand up, sit into the rut, fly this. I'm gonna be a little bit more aggressive here on the downhills. We're going middle rut. Oh, this middle rut is big, dude. It's freaking bolt. It's built up, bro. Oh, no. Turn. I'm flying down this. Hey! Oh, get on the brakes. Get on the bindies. Oh, shit. We're Gucci. And get upside down for the fans real quick. Oh, that was a perfect trip ski. Look at me. Watch me find Jesus. Oh my. I just ended so hard there. Alright, we gotta finish this lap without dying. We go inside on that 180. We go inside to outside around this corner. Oh, Jet Lawrence line. Oh, I missed the inside. Yeah, whatever. Fine. Slow it down, hit this, double, triple, and then you just rail around this. Uphill start as well. I think the start would be really interesting. Uphill to this, like, big double right here. And that's a 2.03.7. We can definitely beat that time. It's got to be a little bit more aggressive. So let's do it, boys. Why don't we? Bro, 
grab that. Oh no. That we're fine. Okay, this is where it's gonna get real sketchy. <gasps> oh god. To lean forward over the bars here. Oh, I can rail that. Oh, that's way better line. Look at the drive you get. Freaking roosting that boy. Oh. That was actually really good. You can sit down. Get that. Sit down here. Stand up. Get to the rut. Sit down. Let's go. Slap is a complete heater so far. Okay, careful, careful. Yep, jump into the middle rut. Reel this. Pull. this and then come down the hill. Oh, oh. Alright, don't die here. Don't do flashbacks. Triple. Oh no, I'm gonna case it. Oh, we're fine. Sit down. How did this guy catch me? How did my ghost catch me? What? I didn't do anything wrong. Dude, these tables are absolute booter patooters, bro. Alright, I'm taking the cheater line. Hey. <laughs> and Jet Lawrence line. That's actually kind of nasty. Oh! I can gain time here. Sit down around this. Oh. I lost a lot of time. Alright, don't care. Sit down. I'm going way outside. What am I doing? <gasps> oh, it didn't even count. Or did it count? No, it didn't count. Oh, I think it was because I took that cheater line. Dude, he's like, he must got them cuts on lock, bro. Cause that wasn't, I wasn't even that far off the track. All right, because I'm stubborn, we're gonna do one more lap. Oh no. Hit that like button if you guys think I am going to break my previous best lap. This is a horrific start, by the way. This should be studied. Oh no. Oh, wait a second. Wait, don't let him get schmeezy, though. Oh, that line was nasty. Them cuts better not be really close, though. Oh, oh God. I'm on real. Someone stop me. Sue me. Ooh. Okay, we're fine. We're just going to keep going. We're just not going to give up. It'd be easy to just give up right now. But we don't do what the easy thing is. And sit down on the rut and scrub dub dub. This is where we have to attack is these right here. I'm jumping all the way into it. Hey, sit down. Oh. No one else is doing that. No one in the game. Actually. Actually, a lot of people probably are. But yeah, no one else is doing it. Anyways, guys, I'm officially retiring. I'm going to be going to bike life after that horrible catastrophe. But anyways, boys, thanks for so much. For, thank you guys so much for watching the video, boys. Look at this podium he's got here with this logo. I love Nugget Boy's logo, dude. Look at that. It's like a cute little, little thing. He might be doing some druggies, but anyways, boys, hit that something like button.